Hi everyone and welcome back to Chess for Charity. In this video, I want to show you a really cool puzzle where there are six rooks in the center of the board with a king and a pawn against two queens and of course a king. So in this position, white can actually win the game. And it turns out it's a mate in 21 moves. There's one line that's a mate in 21 and there's also another line that's a draw. So you gotta be careful which checks you select and how you proceed. If you would like to try to solve it, feel free to pause the video. If not, I'm going to share the solution now. Okay, so in this position, you have two checks as white. You have a check on d8 and you have a check on d7. So which of these two should I look at? Well, of course, when you're calculating, you look at both of them and you wanna see if you can identify the differences between the two options. And generally speaking, I just I just pick one randomly, but let's just say generally speaking, you want to look at which one is more flexible and which one will allow you for more options in the future. Okay, so let's just start with this one. Queen d7, why not? So it turns out in this position, black and block, and you have to pretty much keep checking the king and with every single thing here, the king just keeps getting blocked by the rook. Every check, there's no move for the king, obviously. So either way, you can go back or you can go up. Either way, doesn't really matter. So in this position, this queen is the only one doing anything. This queen's not doing anything because there's no opening. And if I check you, oops, if I check you this way, you don't have to open this this rook up you could just block back the way that it just was and it turns out there's no progress to be made here because like i said there's only one queen in the action this queen's not doing anything so let's say you notice that quite quickly and you say okay that's not working out then so let's go all the way back so in this position we ruled out this move because you feel like you can't get both queens involved so that leads us to this move. And why is this different? Well, this check is more flexible because now after the rook blocks, which is the only legal move, now this queen can get in the action. So you have this pattern happening where you have diagonal movement and then straight line movement, right, along the rank. Okay, so now I have a check. And then, of course, I have to block with this rook because this rook is pinned. So I have one move only. And now look, check with this queen. So look at the way the queen is going, this way and this way. This rook can't move, so this rook has to come up. And then check again. So look at what's happening. I'm checking along all of these squares here, and this queen is jumping from here to here, and you'll see, to here. And again, this rook can't move. This one has to move. Now let's speed up a little bit. So check, only move, check. Now you have a pawn here, not a rook. It has to move forward. And the position essentially repeats itself. So what that means is I start checking like this. The rook blocks, check, rook blocks, check, rook blocks. Do you see the cyclical pattern happening? Check, rook blocks, check, rook blocks. All these checks. Now the pawn blocks. Okay, now you repeat the same cycle again. So look at what this pattern is. Look at the queen hopping around, and this queen also hopping around, but in a different shape. Fascinating, right? All to get this guy. Look at the aesthetics of that. Okay, so let's see how it ends. Check, rook blocks, check, block, check, block. All right, over and over and over. Keep checking and black will have to keep blocking, that's their only move. But lastly, this move is mate, because now there's nothing to block and this rook is pinned. Isn't that amazing? So it's a mate in 21 moves, and you can even make it look like a little tree here. Look at this. Crazy, right? So, really quickly, just to see it in fast motion, check, check, look at all these checks. Isn't that amazing? Just running around, going around and around and around. And this is mate. That's mate in 21 moves. 
If that amazes you like it amazed me, be sure to subscribe. Be sure to like the video. Tell me about how crazy this is, how much you enjoyed it, because I certainly did. But yeah, thanks so much. Bye.